वेलकम टू ऑनलाइन लर्निंग विद राना सो व्यूअर्स इन दिस ट्यूटोरियल वी विल लर्न अ लॉग इन सिस्टम विद एच टी एम एल सी एस एस पी एच पी माई एस क्यू एल एंड कोडिंग नेट सो दीज आर द टेक्नोलॉजी वी विल यूज इन दिस लॉग इन सिस्टम फ्रंट एंड एंड ऑफकोर्स द बैक एंड सो लेट सी वट वी वॉन्ट टू क्रिएट अ लोक सिस्टम जस्ट आई जस्ट गिव यू एन ओवर व्यू सो लेट आई ओपन इन विल ऑफ फाइव फॉक्स सो हेर इज द सिस्टम दिस इज द फ्रंट एंड यूजर नेम पासवर्ड लॉग इन एंड फॉर पासवर्ड सो दिस डे आउट वी विल क्रिएट ऑल एच टी एम एल स्टेप बाई स्टेप and all the css step by step including php and definitely the framework the main framework code by coding editor so we will use this so firstly uh, we will create front end and in the second step we will uh, create our coding editor and the back end so let's start our business so i start from Uh, let's start from scratch so first let's create our directive system maybe i will show you how it will test for the username admin name and this is i think is will fall pass it to my this is the main website data school for the data school so i have created the, the whole project so in this video i will only discuss the login system let's log in and and it will show the password is incorrect so i am i am showing you to how to display the error on the login system with css dear css so i entered my exact password yeah, i think so it will be correct now yes now yeah this is in the login and the whole dashboard created for this login system so this is the main project in the i will cover it in later in my lecture so uh, we will discuss first uh, the login system so when we log in it um, redirect to our dashboard this is the main dashboard for whole system so let's start to create a login system i just log it out and go minimize it and go to my directory structure no e uh, the only exam server of course we will use the exam server dream weaver for front end development and my s my s kill for back end so let, not, let's create our directory new tape login system login system so first directory created i that has been created so just what we required the main the framework coordinator i already download the coordinator and if you inst want to download it go just google it and you will find the coordinator download the source and i already unzip it and we pick and these are the main files i will copy select all copy go to your new directory login and login system here we are i didn't copy that why are there what login system just it new directory login okay paste so guys this is uh, i'm copying the coordinator the framework so we will set uh, all configuration of coordinator basic coordinator certification configuration 
and uh, I am showing you how to create a bracket structure now. So we create here a two new folder for one is images. Definitely there all our main images will be there. New admin underscore CSS CSS and new one CSS. So CSS CSS images. So mm, these are created now. Now let's go to our Dreamweaver and create a new site. This is the main. Mm, I already created the project. Uh, this is the layout. So we will create a new site. Uh, login. Login. Find it. Go up directory. Login. Click OK. Select. Select it. Now go. Click on server. Add your server. I will type localhost. You can type any name. Any name you want. Give your server name. Okay. And, and the next one is local. Because I am creating in a local network. So this is server folder, exactly the login same, select it, ok and give the URL path to access it. So it will be localhost forward slash login and go to advanced and select your server model. This is PHP MySQL. Ok, save it and this is the main thing. Uh, uncheck it and testing because it is testing click on testing and all the configuration i have done in my site so save it now the new site has been created it is creating this the site has been created now all the my directories are showing here so now we will select our directory and uh, the, the default application will show the welcome page of coding it go to Mozilla new tab localhost 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 your directory and it will call yes this is uh, this is uh, the welcome to go to connected page and this is the application views welcome message dot php because it's uh, if you know about coordinator there are model view controller there are uh, there is model view and controller controller is basically to control and uh, work as a mediation between your view front end and back end and back end is your database to uh, uh, extract data from database it will, uh, it will use model so this is the basic concept and if you don't uh, know about code no, do not know about coding director go to google and you find all the information now i am going to uh, configure my application coding director basics configuration so here it is in mean my controller coding director this is the controller and this is model and this is my view by default it is showing on views may this may welcome message or php so mm, i'm not just giving configuring my database yet because the main things we are going to do this uh, this welcome message so we are going to just configure to 
uh, deleting our index file so here it is now just cl click me on my views what's wrong on views welcome message yes this is my welcome message so click on configure click on configure.php so here is our base url what will it be it will be h ttp for which slash localhost and of course our directory login base url index page delete the index page leave it at blank client and what i am doing them because here it, it will show the index the second mm, path is in index and uh, next well, segment i we will discuss the segment in later mm, our video tutorials so i am just going to click uh, my uh, localhost login directory and access my view so why we are this is why we are deleting our index file so delete it and um, one more thing one more thing this is our basic setup of our configuration file so um, uh, definitely we will use encryption so i think we will configure that later so um, just save it and close it and go to your views create new file login.php login.php so it is created and uh, mm, one thing we do it uh, next is to create our controller so i am clicking it and it will customize it or delete it delete it and give it name first letter will be capital so login function index and this load will View. Mm. login dot php and this is of this this one so I delete all the save it and change your class name and the file name file name will be active sensitive ok there is a stuff in text error deleted all all clear now our controller has been created oh, what's wrong with you no Okay, now the load mm, view has been created. Now mm, in view, 
is to test it is accessing or not mm, h2 h1 testing page okay and it is a 404 page in our phone mm, if I get this index yes if I give my controller name login so object is not found is a index and login it's the same issue is I think I have to uh, now set other default controller routes uh, where is default controller routes yes mm, this is mm, because it was welcome so default controller have a login controller yes now there is a syntax error pass error unexpected function on line 6 login.php uh, what's wrong with that where is my controller class login same ci model yes same why it is not deleted this load view login dot php so so we i move uh, we have get our testing base now our model and controller view and controller sorry are connected to each other and we will move forward uh, to create mm, I, let's mm, check my videos on uh, so if my video is mm, long 18 minutes i am quitting it and next in next lecture we will start from here we will study so please do subscribe my youtube channel on Anurana for more videos thank you so much